My guest tonight is a groundbreaking, multi-Grammy winning musical artist who is now making the leap to filmmaker. He may need to change his name, though. His new concert film, Magnificent Coloring World, opens in theaters later this summer. Joining us now from Chicago is the very talented Chance the Rapper. What's going on, Chance? How you doing, man? It's been a while. Everything's good. It's good to see you, man. This is very cool that you uh that you're doing this. this yeah, is awesome. yeah. Good to see you too, brother. Now, now, who are you rooting for in the finals? Um, man, I'm what you call a a bandwagon fan. So okay, I usually if there's a if there's a wagon, I'm the band. If there's a band, I'm the, you know what I mean. I'm I'm yeah. like, so right now I uh, I am very much so in support of the Milwaukee Bucks because. They're close, and uh -huh. Giannis is my dude. But I'm also, like, I've been a close friend of Chris Paul for a really long time, and he's just had, like, a very uh, beautiful journey that I also would love to see this year uh, get him a ring. So I'm, I'm in the middle. But, you know, whoever wins, I will be at their parade for sure. All right. Well, who's your favorite player on the Bucks? My favorite player? Hmm, that's a good one. I feel like... I uh I feel like I've been a Drew Holiday fan for a little while. Uh-huh. Uh, but obviously Giannis is my guy. Brooke Lopez is raw. All Chris right. Middleton really like, you know, took over in the in that in what was it, game six, mm. the last game. But that, uh what, they got what, they got a whole roster. I mean, I guess Giannis is my favorite. And he's got his brother on the team too. Shout out to uh to Giannis's brother. I like that they you know what I'm saying? End up yeah. on the same roster. That's like me and my brother. You know. Now, I mean? now tell me this: What do you and Giannis talk about, man? Uh, how tall he is. <laughs> it's, hard, it's hard not to talk about other things than that. It's like, man, this is crazy. Now, it's how, like, yeah, good to see you. What is the height difference between you and Giannis, man? Six, seven feet? Yes, yeah, it's, it's up there. I don't know. It's like it's the height difference where you could tell when you shake his hand. And he's got your whole forearm and bicep. <laughs> Are you like, all right, man. All right, all right. Well, hey, hey, Chance, we got to take a commercial break. We'll be right back with more Chance the Rapper when we'll come back. I'm Anthony Anderson, a.k.a. Big Daddy. Uh, Chance the Rapper is with us. Now, that was from the brand new trailer from Chance the Rapper's uh, new film, Magnificent Coloring World, opening in theaters late this summer. Now, Chance, you made that trailer. I did. I edited uh -huh. that trailer. All right. Talk, talk to us you. about that process. You know, some, because sometimes the trailer, you know, is better than the movie. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, not saying, because I haven't seen this movie yet. I'm not saying your trailer's better than the movie, but sometimes that's what happens. No, that's a goal for some editors. I edited the movie also, me and a team of three other editors, but the I've spent a long, long time editing the trailer, and I did a teaser trailer before this, but I'm a trailer snob, so, like, if I... I, I like movies to have a better trailer than the movie, just in case I got to convince somebody to watch the movie, you know what I mean? Well, okay, okay, but, but you also made this movie five years ago now? So, so four years ago, I filmed this, right? Okay. I was on tour, and I came up with this crazy idea for uh, a new kind of staging for, for a show, where it's kind of like, instead of just one stage with the crowd kind of centered, it's, uh, it's like a semicircle of, like, five stages connected, and, like, a long row of bleachers across from, from the main stage is where all the fans are. And I, uh, and I shot it on a sound stage in Chicago, and... I didn't know how to edit yet. So it mm -hmm. kind of just sat there. You know what I mean? Right. And uh, last year, I, during the pandemic, I started shooting a lot of uh, my own, like, little virtual concerts and uh, got better with direction and with cinematography and learned a lot about just a lot of different areas of film. And then the editing was kind of, like, the thing that 
uh, that when I picked it up, I was like, I should go back to this project and kind of fix it. So five year anniversary, I was like, let's try and go big with it. So it took you five years to make that trailer. Okay. <laughs> that, that, that's basically what I got out of it. Now, now, now Chance, you're, you're a very positive and high energy guy. Now, no matter where you are, you always look like you're cheering at an NBA Finals game. So we wanted to give you a little quiz. You know, we're gonna show you some photos of yourself having fun, and you have to guess whether it's basketball related or not in a game we call On the Court or On the Town. All right? So here's the first photo. You seem very happy about something, but is this basketball or what? This one is a very difficult one because uh, even though you erased the bottom part of the shirt, I can tell that I was flea and I was getting a fit off. So I want to say that I was at a basketball game, but at the same time, the joy in my face says club. I'm going to go quick. Which one is it? That's my final answer. Court, that's my final answer. All right! You're on the court watching the Bulls play the Celtics in the 2017 playoffs. I don't know why you're smiling. The Bulls lost. <laughs> All right, let's try another one. Mmm, you're oh, drinking yeah. something. But were yeah. you on the court or on the town? The better question is, why'd you erase the straw? I'm making a... <laughs> Because we wanted to make it look like you were whistling. Okay, that is definitely what I'm getting off in this photo. I'm gonna go uh, court again, because there's no way that I could breathe in the club with that. Yeah. Yes! Yes, that sort of probably cost you $28 courtside. Now, this one right here looks like someone is proposing to you. Is it on the court or on the town? That looks like a strip club face I'm making. I'm <laughs> You're out of club? Let's see. Oh! It's at your birthday party. Now, you know I'm pissed you didn't invite me. It ain't like you ain't got my number. Mm -hmm. Next time. Next time. All right, this one is a little I tricky. I think it was we had your name on the list, but I think you told them your name was Big Daddy at the door. Oh, yes. Yes. Now, now it's uh, just healthy and husky. Um, <laughs> all right, this one's a little tricky. This one is tricky. At the club or on the town? I, that's a really nice sweater I have on. Uh-huh. Swe the sweater under the Sherpa jacket is really nice. Yeah. I feel like I only wear shirts like that. When I'm on daytime TV, that's daytime TV. Oh, you're right, it's you on the TV. All right, thank you for playing. Magnificent Coloring World opens in theaters later this summer. The full trailer will drop on Friday. Thanks, Chance. We'll be right back with an all-NBA edition of Mean Tweets.